Hello guys, hope you all are doing good and in this video I'm going to cover everything about the AWS Cloud Practitioner exam. It's a very basic exam. Okay, and I'll tell you that how much time like will it take for you to clear this exam and how in the end like uh, I'm actually preparing for it like next month I'm going to give the same exam. So how you can prepare uh, like parallelly with me. Okay, so let's start. Before that, let me tell you the some prerequisite. So I feel that like there is no prerequisite for this exam, even if you are in your college. Okay, like you are doing any engineering course. Okay, BCA, BSc, you can pursue this course, and I'm sure like you'll be able to clear it because it's very basic. So as you all know that AWS has three tiers of exam. Okay, this is tier one. Uh, tier 2 and tier 3. So the cloud practitioner one is the very basic program. It comes into tier 1 Okay, like the introduct introduction of everything all the cloud services Practitioner one the second one is uh, architect and developer one developer associate In this we have sysops associate also and the third one is the professional one Okay, architect professional, sysops professional. So this is like uh, pretty tough and the passing marks of all these three are different also. So maybe that we can clear in like that we can talk in some other video. So in this like, uh, so like you would have understood that there is no prerequisite. Okay, if you have like if you are in college, you can easily pursue and even if like uh, you have two to five or maybe 10 years of experience, then it will be easy for you to understand the things, grab the concepts and uh, like in the end clear the exam. Okay. So I personally feel that like one week is more than enough to clear this exam because like it's all basic. It's start with the EC2 services. Okay. Go on. Like uh, the thing is that they will cover each and every basic services and okay. So like one week, to two weeks or at max like one month is enough for you to clear this exam okay and after that let comes to free resources so like there are so many resources available on the net and i have jotted down some of the free resources and the best best one is this course okay so this is the course by free code camp you can check it out it's i think 13 hours course okay and i'm sure like it covers most of the things cloud fundamentals core services okay so this is very important the identity security and governance okay billing price and support so this is like a very okay and this uh, like if you see that like this is tier one exam which i have talked about okay and these are tier two so after that like developer associate solution architect associate and these are professional ones so this is devops engineer professional and solution architect professional perfect so i hope this is clear to you and so if you are going towards free resources i'll say free code camp and i will also give this link to you you can search it on youtube okay free code camp this is almost 13 hours of video and this is more than enough for you to just go through the basic in like the outline of the exam and to clear the exam. Uh, after that, the paid courses. So here, like I have selected the Udemy course and the reason of me selecting the Udemy course is that like I have done my architect associate exam and I have studied from the Udemy. So there is a course by Stephen Marik. It's really good. And this is for the cloud practitioner one. Don't go on the price. You can get it in cheap. Also, I'll link down the like link to this uh, Udemy course. Okay, so you can go through this course. It's it's pretty extensive and just look at the number of reviews it it has got. Okay, almost like 1.3 lakh students and such a good rating. One of the best sellers on Udemy. Okay, and if you just go through the content, so the same which the free code camp guys have uh, like gave. Okay, the Amazon S3 integrations, monitoring, and these are important stuff. And like uh, I am looking, see 14, 15 hours. So this is kind of equivalent. 
and the benefit of this Udemy course is that you will get a mock exam with like one mock exam with this okay I, I strongly recommend you to purchase a another Udemy course with mock test that will surely help you to like prepare prepare for the exam okay the exam regarding exam info this is for around hundred dollars so you can say in INR that will be like around 7k to 8k depending on taxes and all other things I'm sure like it will be more than 8k okay the bank charges some some amount also so that is it and uh, like you can take this exam from either from your home or from the center and like I strongly suggest you to take, take this exam from the center because there are so many variables which you have to take in mind while giving the exam from home okay so this is it i hope uh, like uh, you will have now you have a basic understanding of what this exam is about and how much time will it take to you to clear it and as i have told you that next month i'll be appearing for this exam okay and in case you are interested in appearing with me and to prepare with me so in the description box you will find a google uh, sheet link okay so you can fill it out and uh, based on the responses i will just uh, have that information and maybe in some other video i can tell you that how we can prepare together because i really want to help the community so that like uh, so the benefit of studying together is that in case i have any doubt i can like refer it to someone else okay similarly you have any doubt you can always come to me and ask that okay how this thing is doing um, the same you can do in udemy course also but it's always nice to interact like uh, one to one so that is uh, like uh, my motive of uh, adding this portion so that's it guys uh, i hope you have found this video useful and uh, just comment down below that wh what is the motive of you preparing for this exam and why exactly do you want to take this exam so that's it guys thank you shailesh kumar signing off bye